Steel drums are nothing more than it's one piece of metal and you're building sine waves that come off of that metal with harmonics. And because it's one piece, those things ring into each other or not. This is entirely by hand. Everything. It's pretty smooth. Yeah, it is. They have pneumatic hammers now with it. Oh, they can get and do little tiny little mm -hmm. hits, yeah. I've, oh. I've used those too, but I kind of like the hand detail. Right. It's a little bit more cool. precise. I haven't touched them much, and so I was kind of stressed out about it, to be honest. <laughs> so he gives me this part, and I'm like, oh. This would be easy on piano or something I'm looking at it going yeah I could probably not and I can see how it works but the range wasn't for the one that I play the best it was the range was for the the uh, double seconds which is like an alto range so I got those out and I was while they were doing some other stuff keyboard fixing and stuff I practiced for like three hours on this part okay I think I got it Great. Yeah. By the end of the first pass, I was actually got it. The whole song it was okay. It wasn't a big deal. So it, instead of piecing it together little by little, we were able to just play it, which was cool because um, I think that's a better vibe than like, okay, let's fix this little section, two bars, and then paste it together. It's, it sounds better to have a performance. Last song of the album had this kind of earthy feel to it. The main instrument I chose was the frame drum. And it was the sort of the key center, if I recall, was D, like a D drone over the whole thing. So um, I brought the one that I have that's best for that note. And it's really, the intonation is really spot on with the track. So it sounds like a bass. like this one it's more leaving the right amount of space I just sort of fabricated that space by not playing a bunch of embellishments not playing a bunch of this kind of language just kind of playing the parts and playing what was called a doom which is a bass tone or the tech which is like your fingertips on the edge and just kind of playing those things really like a skeleton and leaving a lot of space <laughs> 